Hi, my name's Manmi. I'm one of the Life Sciences Technicians at BCU. I'm also a graduate on the Biomedical Sciences course here at BCU. And today I'll be going through the equipment and facilities that we have on the course. So if patients got suspected flu um, or RSV infection, the sample will go into the machine, it will be amplified, and the specific targets, if they are reached and the amplification, they'll show that the patient has flu and you'll be able to treat them for the flu or RSV infection. This analyzes urine samples. So this is important to get treated. It's quick and easy to use and it'll produce you with a receipt-like result where you can read whatever's inside your sample. So this is the MUSE flow cytometer. We use this during the pharmacology module and this measures the amount of live and dead cells that are from our soil culture environment. So the students will load samples onto this machine that have been treated, that have different cytokines in them. And then you can see from the screen here, it shows you the apoptotic cells and live cells. So you can see the efficacy of drug usage on cells to see if they survive or not. So this is the cell culture facility that we have on site. And here we grow and culture our own cells, which we use in practicals. We have a range of cell lines which we nurture with liquid nitrogen and store them in the minus 80. What we use these cultures are for are applied with PhD students and in real life environments such as cancer diagnosis, um, cancer research and further pharmacology so we can do drug development with these cells and drug testing so we can further improve the medical environment with the research that's done in this facility. We have different models that the lecturers use as well. We're able to develop and improve the medical industry with the research that's done here.